then let's go get a forced approach. Okay, so A, aviate. So 70 knots, we trim, carve it out. And B, we pick the field. So we can pick a good field. Do you see the water sprinkler there? Yeah. Do you see the field right next to it? Yeah. That's, that's not the best field, but just to make it clear, we're just gonna use that brown field over there, okay? Okay. Okay, so we pick the field, and we're gonna make a plan. So wind looks pretty calm. So let's just plan to land this way. Sure. To the east, uh, to the west. Okay, I made my plan. So we're gonna do it. So I'm gonna probably just turn around and circle once and then make a circuit. So the field is pretty close. That's why I'm using circling and then circuit. Okay. okay. Every 500 feet, do a warm up. Okay, cost check. Do the pre landing check. The primer is in, master is on, max on both. And carbines out, extra rich, fuel is on both. Try to restart. No, it's not restarting. Okay, distress. Transponder 7700 and radio 1215. Mayday, mayday, mayday. This is Cessna 172, Golf Alpha Mike November, Golf Alpha Mike November, Golf Alpha Mike November. We are south over Crescent Island, 2,000 feet. Two people on board. We have an engine failure and we're going to land on one of the farmers here. Okay, passenger, dear passenger. We, unfortunately, we had an engine failure, so we're gonna have to land on one of these fields. So do you see this brown field down here? Yeah. We're gonna land on there. So take anything sharp out of your pocket. If you're wearing glasses, take it off. And make sure you do your seat belts. And before we land, can you please unlatch the door? Okay, so that's what we did. Okay, and doing the circling right over the field, right? Yeah. Then I'm gonna do the final check. Mixture cut, and then turn off the max, and then fuel off, just to prevent fire. And then, we're gonna keep the master for flaps, okay? So, I'm always keeping the field on the left for you, right? Yep. Okay, we're right over the field, we're gonna exit. Okay, now we're gonna join the downwind. Lost some altitude during the circling. Let's join the downwind. So I'm keep. I'm gonna have to keep 70 knots all the time. Hey, okay, now we join the downwind, right? Yeah. Okay, 1,000 feet, my last warm-up. And there's some power line. So, I'm gonna turn base now. So, do you think I'm gonna make 40% of the field? Yeah. Yeah, okay, we can put 10 flat. 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, 20%, we're gonna make it. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, one, two, three, 20 flaps. And then we're gonna make 20% of the field, like 10%, like the threshold. Yeah, we'll put full flap. And go 60 knots. And if we keep 60 knots, we're probably gonna go right over the power line and land, right? Yeah. But we're not gonna go that low. And you can always do like four wrist like this, the worst case. Okay, I'm gonna overshoot, full power, RV in, 520 right away, 